Welcome back to another Mad Human Pizza video, MHP. So in this video we're going to be removing that thing right there with that tool right there. So without further ado, let's get to it. Let's do it. So here we are. See this? You need a certain kind of torque spit that engineers and uh, professional mechanics and the people at the at the uh, dealerships they don't want you to know about so you get you a, a couple of these Torx bits right here and then you are free to work on your own vehicle and not pay extortionate amounts of money to do your job so take this there's four fasteners right here 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 and here and then a bit and then a electrical connector right, connection right there and with this I would say disconnect the negative battery because it, it's so easy to do so just disconnect that and then from there take this take that electrical connection out and I'm gonna do it right now after I get my trusty gloves on because cars are filthy so let's get that connection off Has that connection and it's got a little gasket a red gasket on it and then next thing to do is to take those fasteners off eh, I'll record as I'm taking each fastener off why not anyway let's get the gloves on and so working on this car here it's like it's like playing a video game where you collect coins or you collect artifacts or you collect all kind of stuff that's what taking apart this Mazda 626 is just like. It's like collecting stuff and you get rewarded by um, caching and just, you know, C-A-C-H-E. You know, you cache, you store, you collect, all kind of stuff. Like this bolt right here. I'll, uh, the camera, I'll collect this bolt, this uh, screw or whatever, that fastener. I always say fastener because fastener can mean bolt, screw, anything that holds things together. But anyway, um, it's like playing a video game. Just like fixing up your house or apartment is like playing The Sims. You know, you upgrade stuff, and then you just do all kind. You move stuff around. You clean. You just and you go to work and you do all kind of stuff, and. That's like playing The Sims, like fixing the house up. And the car is kind of, it can be real rewarding to fix if you really have to fix this. Or, you know, if I'm making this video, it's rewarding to make the video to show somebody, hey, this is what you got to go through to take this off and put it back on. And it's very rewarding that it actually helps people. And it, it's not so rewarding when people cuss you out and stuff, but you'll have that. Anyway, anyway. I got three of them off. I got one more to go. And get this last fastener off. I already got the thing disconnect the electrical part. And just tearing down a car and collecting all the fasteners. I have a whole cooler. Half a cooler filled with fasteners. Fasteners from my other cars. Other car, whatever. I tore down. I made a bunch of videos on. That was very fun. And I could use those fasteners for other stuff. So I got those fasteners off, and there, you can take the top part of it, if you want to access the top part, that is really cool. Look at that. Look at that, There's that technology right there, you got electronics in there, you can see all the little, um, that's where all the um, little, uh, little cool things. See the little traces, the copper traces, and all the little resistors in there. I'm sure there's some capacitors somewhere. And this chip right here, this big chip right here, is a 1997 Ford. Isn't that cool? It says 1997 Ford. I'm just read it to you. Uh, 0606 CFK C512 slash CN. So it's got a, it's a Ford chip and other ones are they don't have any names on them 
but this is really cool and here's this um, the number for the main the uh, chip I'm, I'm looking at this upside down so f82 capwb5757 and the number you can see there's like cogs in there but the number there we go all right f I'm on focus. Anyway, I'll, re I'll read it to you. F eight two F nine C seven three four dash A C. There's a dash up here too. Made in Mexico. So this is made in Mexico. Okay, now that we saw inside the cruise control module, let's for giggles take the whole module out. So I have a ten millimeter in it on an extension a 3 8 inch drive so take one fastener and there's one fastener up around that area so we'll do that take it off there all right once you take those two fasteners out and pull that out the only thing you have to get out now is the uh this cable and so i'm gonna go mess around with it and get that out so watch this thing like that alright we got this off here that's off uh, step by step we're getting it okay don't worry about that up there now we just need to get this part off on the side and I'll show you here as, as I get this glove on I'll show you what I mean this right here where the cable goes in there isn't that cool that's pretty cool isn't it I thought so almost got it okay so I got that wire out of there and now it's got to pull the whole thing out what's it doing there we go trying to not focus come on focus there you go and that's got to pull the whole thing out let me put this back on the tripod all right let's zoom out a little bit and then let's take this out put my gloves back on for the eighth time still beats getting dirt on them there you go here is magnificent cruise control module without electronics in it that's what the old generation liked they didn't like electronics but the new gener new generations came in made a bunch of electronics made the riches and just got rid of all the dinosaurs goodbye coal goodbye natural gas goodbye oil well you can still make plastic but goodbye here comes solar, solar energy wind all kinds bio fuels let's get out of here with your fossil fuels have a great day oh, i guess i'm not done with this stupid part so there's a bunch of fasteners i took off and now you get to adjust this camera for you guys and just take these fasteners off there's three of them Five sixteenth, five sixteenth inch, whatever, and imperial, imperial units, and there you go. You can make the. Now it looks naked, so cool, huh? Now it's like a brick. There you go.